If you enjoy the video and my content, please consider supporting my channel over on Patreon at patreon.com slash katedidart. Thanks so much! Hello, hello, my adorable squidlings. Katie here, and today I'm going to be opening up the February 2019 Palletful Packs box. If you don't know what Palletful Packs is, I do have information in the description um, covering prices and shipping and all that good stuff. So if you're interested, check out the description, and there will also be a link to where you can go check them out. So let's get to opening the box. So right up on top, there is a card and February's Petite Pack, which is the one I get, is the theme is Karen, Kerin, I'm going to say Karen, uh, brush markers. So that's exciting. And then this is the supply list. On the back here, they have a couple of hashtags, Palletful Prompt and Palletful Packs. And then they have four different um, prompts for the week, Urban, Old, Love, and Stairway. Um, actually, I think that's really cool, and I'm really glad that they're doing prompts. Um, so we'll see where that takes us. Then we've got the paper worms, which are my favorite, even though they get everywhere. <laughs> and then we've got the items. So let's get out these. All right, so we've got four Karen brush markers. Here's what they look like, really nice. I've got one in sapphire blue, one in indigo blue, one in turquoise, and then one in cool gray. Uh, let me open up one of these really quick. Here's what they look like. So they've got a nice, really juicy looking uh, tip, and I will swatch them out for you, uh, but they're really nice, and uh, hopefully I like them because I like brush markers, so I'm excited to use them. <sighs> Next up, I'm really excited. <laughs> uh, I don't know if you know me, but I love Micron pens. So we've got a Micron in black 05, Micron in black 03, and then we also have a brush here is each tip, the 05 on top, 03 in the middle, and then the brush and the end. Um, you can also see them right there. Uh, but yeah, they got some nice tips, and I actually recently threw away one of my microns because it ran out, so yay! Then, the next item, and what seems to be the last item in this box, is a 4x6 sketch pad by Art Alternatives. And it has, where does it not say? Aha! It's 80 sheets and it is 75 pounds. Um, so it means it's pretty thin. So typically just your average sketch paper and they are perforated on the side. So you can actually rip your pages out if you want. Yeah, I don't know how they'll work with these markers in particular, but I guess we'll swatch them out and see. Time to swatch out those art supplies. So I'm starting with the Karen markers. And the first thing I noticed is how juicy and vibrant these markers are, especially on this paper. They seem to have a lot of ink. The brush tip is actually really nice, uh, just first impression. Um, and again, I really like the colors and I like the color selection. They're very um, cold feeling and I kind of enjoy that. So I'm excited to see what I can do with an illustration with these. Um, Another thing I noticed is that they are um, water soluble, so I used a water brush pen and I dissolved them and they dissolved really well actually. <laughs> so that'll be something I could possibly put toward my illustration. Uh, swatching out some Micron pens, I already know I love these, so no surprise there. Honestly, they're absolutely great. The brush pen will be nice for adding some line weight as well. And of course the sketch pad was really nice. Um, it worked well with these supplies, so yeah. All right, so now we're off onto the illustration, and I thought that I would go ahead and work on one of the prompt words. So I'm doing week number four, which is stairway. I think it's really cool that they decided to start doing prompts, so I'm excited to do that. I may not get to all of them, but I at least want to do one. <laughs> So in this pack, um, we've got the Karen Brush Marker Pro, as you saw earlier, and all of those combined in this box have a retail value of $13. The Pigma Micron pens combined have a total retail value of $8.97. And then the Art Alternatives Hardcover Sketchbook comes in at a retail value of about $6.15. 
Um, so combined retail, at least according to the card, is $28.12. It's still more than what I paid for the box. I pay $24 a month for it because I get the petite box. So I am relatively happy. I think my biggest critique on this box is the paper. Um, lately in the petite box, they've been sending us just a lot of basic sketch pads, and I think it would have been a lot more beneficial had they sent maybe a smaller pad of Bristol like they did for the premiere pack this month. They got a large pack of Bristol paper, um, and I think they would have worked really nicely with these markers. That is not to say that this paper didn't work nicely with these markers because I was able to still get watercolor effects with the markers and um, really great color payoff on this paper. I just wish that it was a thicker paper because, um, you know, warping and all that stuff is a big problem. So overall, that's my biggest critique on the box. I, I really like the markers. They're ridiculously vibrant and they blend really well together, especially the tip to tip method. Um, and I got this like beautiful set of blues, which I really like. And they are the most juicy markers I've ever used. Holy heck, like they, <laughs> they will get on anything and everything if they even touch it. So you might want to be aware of that, but they're very, very heavily juicy, heavily juicy. I've got a lot of ink. Um, so yeah, and I did use a water brush to kind of supplement this set because I wanted to take advantage of all of the water-based stuff <laughs> with the, um, with the markers. So, you know, I am filming at a different angle. Let me know what you think of it. I don't know. I'm still experimenting with different angled filming, so this probably, um, will not be the kind of end-all be-all of this angle. I don't know. Let me know. What are your opinions on side angling? Um, do you like the over-the-top view better? Do you like this better? Maybe a different side view angle, which is what I'm kind of leaning toward. Uh, let me know in the comments below. Um, I got a new like little tripod arm thing and so I'm trying to figure things out. So I really like the mood of this overall piece. I'm pretty happy with it. Um, I had no idea what to do for Stairway um, and when my patrons see my sketchbook tour that's coming later this month, they'll definitely understand my struggle because I went through a lot of thumbnails before I found this one. And it's kind of off the wall but I actually really like it so oh well. But yeah, um, if you got the Palatful Packs Petite or Premier box, let me know in a comment down below what you thought of it. Um, I think that the Karen markers are really awesome and I would definitely love to get more. Um, I would love to, I don't know, play with them more. They're just really fun markers and I don't know, I really liked them. So I'm glad to have found a different brand, um, you know, to test out, I guess. <laughs> so anyway, um, I want to thank you all so much for watching the video. It is coming to a close, and you're actually going to be looking at the final piece after I get done with all of my fun little uh, details. Um, but anyway, thank you so much, as always, for watching this video. If you are already a part of our cute squid pod, there's a subscribe button down below. I also have social media links in the description below as well. And until next time, my adorable squidlings, toodaloo!